Hey guys, welcome back to Planet J Judah. And today, as of the recording of this, it is Thursday, November 14th, which was also my mommy-in-law's thyroid epi thyroidectomy. Oh my goodness, I can't, I can't speak. So first thing this morning, we went to the hospital and got her all set up. And of course, I brought along with me some yarn. And I made this beautiful infinity scarf out of probably one of my favorite ever. It's a Red Heart Super Saver. This is a jumbo. As you can see, I also had to find my matching uh, headband, which I made that a long time ago. So this is in the colorway Starburst, Starburst print. There you go. So yeah, that is the colorway and I love how it works up. It's probably one of my all time favorite ever colorways cause it's just beautiful and it creates this beautiful print. I've made a coaster out of it and I've made this headband, but today I made this infinity granny stitch scarf and I used the flat granny stitch so it was very simple. I'll take it off really quick. Alrighty, so I made the infinity scarf using, like I said, the flat granny stitch. Whereas the headband is a rectangle uh, granny stitch. But look, isn't that gorgeous? I just love how the colors work up. And to me, it feels like, I don't know, it feels like fall. It, it looks like and feels like fall to me or a bunch of flowers. So maybe spring, but oh my goodness, I absolutely love this colorway. I absolutely love this infinity scarf. And so Daryl's mom had her surgery, had a complete removal of her entire thyroid the surgery went well, and she is staying overnight at the hospital for observation. And while I was there, because I went with her, we went first thing in the morning. We we got there at about 6.30. Her surgery didn't start until set, uh, 8, sorry, 8 o'clock. So we went, we got through registration. We went back to the staging area. They picked her up to go to the OR at about eight and for about a half an hour I was crocheting this and then she was done and I got to go up to her room before she did because she was in recovery and then she came up and we just hung out we hung out for oh gosh a few hours and then I had to come home because Daryl needed the car to go to work so, but yeah, I just worked this up while I was at the hospital and I finished it here at home when I had to be home and I joined it. Probably not the greatest join, but you're not going to see that, but I did a whip stitch and I don't know my... You can't really see it, but let's see. My two ends didn't exactly <laughs> match up, uh, but that's fine. It, it is what it is. But, um, but yeah, so I joined it, made it an infinity scarf, finished it, and here we are. So in the next couple of clips, you're going to see me making the starting the scarf and then finish well not quite finishing it but almost finishing it here at home so i start at the hospital and then finish it here at home so enjoy and i will put celtic music because that's what i crocheted to all day today i hope you enjoy see you in a bit
Alrighty. Well, I hope you enjoyed today's video. There is a multiple of ways that you could wear this. I just happen to really like it like this. It's very comfortable. And I'm sure that once I wash it, it'll become very soft and a lot more pliable because this is a little stiff. But like I said, once I wash it, once I wash it, I'm sure it'll be a little bit more pliable, but I absolutely love it like this. And you could do it any number of ways. I am at 100% positive. I just like doing it this way. I have it wrapped twice. So there's three, one, two, three of the layers and each one getting a little closer to my neck from the first one. So, but anyways, like I said, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I'm a little chaotic. I, I have been up since two o'clock this morning. I am very tired <laughs> and it is now 9.37 p.m. So if you like this video, I would love it if you'd hit the like button. And if you'd like to be notified of any and all future uploads, hit the subscribe button. And with that, remember, gravity works, guys. Mm -hmm.